Earthbed. Good day, learners. This is Earth Pen. We will be discussing the zeroth law of thermodynamics. The fourth law of thermodynamics is actually called zeroth law. This law was lately understood while the three laws have been around already. But the concept of zeroth law is so fundamental that it should go before the other laws. So instead of renaming the other laws, this law is named zeroth law. The zeroth law of thermodynamics states that if two thermodynamic systems are each in thermal equilibrium with a third, then they are in thermal equilibrium with each other. In simpler words, if A is in thermal equilibrium with B, and A is also thermal equilibrium in another body of C, thus B is in thermal equilibrium with C. A equals B equals C. This law seems so basic but it actually mathematically defines the temperature. Bodies reaching thermal equilibrium means that there is already no heat transfer because these bodies have the same amount of heat. For example, you place a fresh meat in the refrigerator overnight. The next morning, you will assume that your meat already reached the thermal equilibrium with the refrigerator because basically, heat will flow if it is exposed in unbalanced systems. Another example is when you measure your room temperature and you got 27 degrees Celsius. According to zeroth law of thermodynamics, you can assume that your room and the other things in your room Pillows, cabinet, and couch have the same temperature of 27 degrees Celsius. Now, this law is fundamentally applied in our thermometers. As we put our thermometer in a hotter body, as the temperature increases, the mercury expands and increases in the tube. The change of height of mercury in the thermometer indicates the change in the temperature. That is all for now. I hope you learned something today. Once again, this is Earth Pen. Learning has never been this easy for anyone, anywhere. Have a nice day.